Now let's have a look at the very first cause, which is status. Now what is status? That is how important you feel within your company, how valued you are by your co-workers. And it's very easy to knock somebody's status by constantly knocking their performance or criticizing them, even for things that don't necessarily affect you yourself. So you can end up over a long period of time of people who have been criticized a lot and yet not credited for the things that they do well. And this can threaten their status, make them feel very undervalued. Now this can happen at either end of the hierarchy if you think about it. You can end up with those that are right in the entry level of the company doing the most basic jobs and yet if they feel valued and useful to the other co-workers then they can feel fine, their status is good. On the other hand you get people at the very top end of the hierarchy, those senior managers and directors and if they are constantly hassled, knocked, by not having their performance knocked and they can end up feeling very unimportant themselves with their status threatened. So people at either end of the hierarchy can end up with burnout caused from a problem of lack of status. Number two is certainty, and that is the need to be able to predict the near future. There's been a lot of studies done in terms of psychology and neuroscience to check and see how the lack of certainty can make a difference to your stress levels. For example, if you pick something up small and you're going to put it in your mouth and you pretty much know what it's going to taste like, then your certainty is quite high and your stress levels are low. On the other hand, if you're at school and a bunch of kids are giggling at you and watching carefully to see as you put that thing in your mouth, then your certainty drops and your stress levels raise. That's a very basic example. When it comes to jobs, though, you may find that your certainty drops if there's a threat around whether you're going to be able to keep your job or if you're unsure about the objectives of your work, if you're unsure about the relationships between you and others in the workplace, or if you're dealing with unpredictable and nervous clients. Now this, over a long period of time, can take your focus off your goals. <laughs> Including mine, right now. It can take your focus off your goals. And then when your certainty drops, When your certainty drops over a long period of time, this can be a major cause for burnout. Dreadful!